Time is your most precious resource. It's perishable, limited, irretrievable, and irreplaceable, and above all else, unstoppable. Time is perishable. It doesn't last. It's fleeting and quickly gone. Its shelf life is almost wholly dependent on the perception of whoever is the subject and whatever they've got going on. Eventually, though, no matter who you are or what your perception, you realize that time goes away and doesn't come back. People close to dying are intimately aware of this fact. Time is limited. Similar to being perishable, it is limited. The human condition means that if I'm lucky, I'll be dead in 30 years. If I'm not so lucky, I'll be dead in five years. And if I'm really snake eyed out, I mean, just in a bad way, I won't even make it till next week. Very few of us will get more than 100 years alive on this earth. As our condition and science currently stand, we don't have that capability. Every creature and everything is temporary. We are all bits and pieces of matter and energy that were themselves bits and pieces of other matter and other energy that were repeatedly converted from matter to energy and back again in new configurations innumerable times. But each isolated definitive configuration of matter or energy only exists for a specified time before it ceases to exist at all. Time is irretrievable. Once it has passed, you can't get it back. I know theories about time travel abound, but even if a time traveler went back in time to alter the past, I posit that what they will be altering is a bifurcated branch that is independent of the original reality. There are many superhero movies and TV shows out now that discuss these types of alternate realities, but me and my fellow geeks have been swimming in these waters for decades. Between comic books and Einstein and heavy metal magazine, M-Theory, Stephen Hawking and sci-fi movies, many of you, like me, have wrestled with and contemplated myriad ideas on the subject ad nauseum. And what my contemplation says is that once distinct time is gone, it's gone forever. Time is irreplaceable. Not much more to say here. Time is a singularity and nothing in our known, theorized, or imagined existence can replace its facility. This fact alone demands that those who wish to lead an excellent life study and learn the ways to navigate the oceans of time. Time is unstoppable. Perpetually moving forward, it is the ultimate juggernaut. I have this artifact that I created I call the freezing cube. Imagine a cube with a single straight thread on one side and myriad other threads that converge to a single point on the opposite side. Now this cube is steadily moving from the single thread side to the myriad thread side. And as it passes along, the myriad threads are burned away and or fused together, leaving only a single thread. In this example, the myriad threads are meant to represent all of the possibilities of all of the actions a person can take, with their choices being the point of convergence. The cube is time itself steadily and unwaveringly moving along, burning away everything that could have been and combining what's left into what is. It's like the Super Mario Brothers video game. You couldn't resist that wall. It was always moving and it would push you along if you tried to stop. And what happened as it passed by, a point became final. This is my understanding of the way of time. I'll cover some time management strategies in another session. Anything on the subject of time management by Brian Tracy or Napoleon Hill is probably a good place to start. Thanks for listening.